chaos died down, we kept asking the simple question, why are you here? What's your message? This is what the organizer of this entire event told us. Well, right now it's kind of vague. As it stands right now, that message team will reveal that tomorrow morning. To support people. People, of course. Time out, time out. Oh, shush, I already told you that. Do, do you want to talk? You want to yell? Child 13, why are you here? Child 13, I'm here. why are you here? Child 13, what are you doing here? Time out. Hey. Forest, there's trees everywhere. It's a beautiful day. And then out of the troll lady has been a model citizen for years, an entertainer of children and elderly alike, a seeming pillar of the community. Or is she? Hi, welcome to the Troll Store. These imagination caps. I don't know if you brought The real yours, question is, you have one. is she no, simply you you right. an innocent so entertainer one. of children? And on three, we'll put them on. Or is there a one, hidden meaning two, behind the trolls? Uh, trolls have what we call a troll philosophy, which is you get along, you, you take care of your business, and you get along, and you help another one if he needs help. But um, basically, trolls don't approve of violence. They would, if, no, mud hats are the bad guys. And they the job, and they, they stay there most of the time. Yeah, all the way around. The problem, of course, biggest problem is with the mud hats, but we don't want to talk about those guys yet. And they are not very nice. And um, why, are the, why are those trolls hiding? Well, they, we have trolls everywhere. Well, I'm going to tell you about all these. And then you yeah. Mud hats, here is one. I don't think William likes mud hats a lot, no. Do you like mud hats? No. During their searches, our investigators found several different people with interesting views on the troll lady. Yeah, I worked with them for a while. You know, there, there was always something a little off. Like, I don't understand why you would create fictional characters like the Mud Hats just to be hated. Seems a little racist to me. So I've been letting little Dina go to Troll Story Time, and it's been great. I've heard great things about it. She's been having such a good time. But then it started. At school, she started calling kids mud hats. And mud then, hat. Oh, mud. No, 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 Dina. We don't. We don't say that. She called the little black kid a mud hat. We had to meet with the principal. I did not raise my daughter to be a racist. Do you know? As bad as During all our thought. interviews, the and, only and question scary. she has been really they happy to answer for us was where she was from. Finland. This information led us to the end of our investigation. The answer. The truth. There are Inuit tribes in Finland that have long been looked down upon by the locals in the area. A popular ethnic slur for the Inuit tribes is Gojehode, or mud hats. So the real question is, what are you willing to subject your children to? Well, I don't know what it is. We don't know. We've never seen it, but it makes a lot of noise. There's usually, it gets messy. The mud hats bring mud bombs and stuff, and... Then trolls have to throw troll magic on mud, mud hats, and you know they, sometimes there are little fights. But trolls and don't like to fight. The, and then do the guardian trolls come and try to get them out? Too? Well, everybody tries to get them out. Even the guardian trolls. Yeah. yeah. So there you go. Or, all right. And now it's up to you to make your own decision. It, Just remember. There you go. Racism. Um, it won't go away even when you have a shower.